Personally, I like the poster. The poster. Anyone? I like the radio advert. Radio. Poster's my favourite. I tell you, it's just very eye catching. It makes you look at it and say what's going on there. I like the lighting, I like the candle, the way that's in there. Yeah, also the, kind of the hand and kind of the ominous figure behind is quite mysterious. It's very scary. It sounds very crisp. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. I think that's probably the idea of the poster, isn't it? It roughly yeah. shows the idea of like what the movie might be based upon, what it might be, what it might be. Yeah, plus it's a horror film, so you can't. Yeah, I'm guessing it's a horror. Film. Yeah. So, um, yeah, you can't give everything away. So, yeah, because it's a horror film, that's ample information. The only thing I would say is that print along the middle bit over her chest is very small. So it makes it could bigger. Be bigger. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, so the next question. What else do you think we can improve on other than that? The print. Bond? What, just on the poster? Yeah, just on the poster. <laughs> Maybe to make it a bit darker, the tone. I think the, um, you know, the review yeah. the top. Maybe that could be worded differently. Yes. Yeah. So you understand every single bit of it? Or does it confuse you a bit? No, that's pretty clear. Yeah. I, thought. I think you get the idea. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, maybe it was a bit too slow. Yeah, I was thinking you could have sped it up a bit. Mm -hmm. If I was being hypercritical, yeah. I didn't like the old lady's voice. I don't think it was the right voice wasn't for the film. Halloween enough. No, it wasn't. <laughs> I didn't like that if I was being if I was being critical. Yeah. I didn't like the girls' Which voice. Not yeah, I didn't, I didn't like the girls' voice. But it made me realise why you have auditions for things, and, and it's not only the look of the characters. It's, yeah. It's the whole thing. That person, her voice didn't do it for me. So do you think her voice should be scarier? So okay. there was just something yeah. about her twang. I don't know what it was, but it just wasn't quite right for the film. Okay. I feel like it didn't fit the um the time Character. period. Mm. Oh right, okay. Yeah. Yeah. The music yeah. was the most effective really, bit. Really yeah. The music was yeah. really good. Yeah. It's really good. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. So you think it's good? Okay. Yeah. Well done, Natasha. So. I think so. Yeah. 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 Fade in that perfectly at the right times. Create the right tension. I was on edge. Okay. Yeah. Um. <laughs> yeah, I think it was. Yeah. Mm. Did there was you? one point where I thought the music came in really strong. Yeah. A bit too strong early. I can't remember where it was. I think she might have been on the stairs. Potentially. I could be wrong. So but it came like in banging? really loud. Okay. No, no, the piano. Oh. It came in really loud, but I think if it faded in, perhaps it might create okay. you know, that sort of tension that you're going for. Okay. Um. Yes, but it could have been more effective. Yeah. I think maybe her gasp was a bit too um, prolonged. I don't know, like not in, uh, it gasped me enough. Yeah. yeah. Okay. The gasp was a very gasp. You don't have to say yes for all of these. Because... No, we're not. We're being critical. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah. I think also uh, towards the end, the the bit between when she finds out that it's not she's not sleeping in the bed and when she goes downstairs, mm -hmm. that's kind of perhaps a bit. Long. Yeah. It's kind of if you want to make the audience a bit more confused about what's going on in the way that like a bit disorientated. Okay. Um, shortening the amount of time between the two events would have made it better, I think. Okay. So well, I think we've touched upon it, haven't we? Potentially a bit more pace, change of voice for the old lady. Yeah. Um, but there were some very effective bits in it. I liked it when you. The focus changed, there was a bit, I think, mm -hmm. to her hand doing yeah. that, I liked that. Mm -hmm. And the, the shots where there was kind of a candle to her face, that was a really cool lighting. So you know how they changed from... The bright the lights, yeah, yeah, that was good. And yeah. then to green. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Definitely. Immediately. That was really good. Okay. I expect you to say no. Because <laughs> <laughs> people keep saying no for these. Oh no, I like it. I like it. Yeah, the radio is really good. good. Okay. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Yeah. Short, sharp, 30 seconds. No, it's spot on. Okay. Mm -hmm. Enough to want to go see it. You do want yeah. to go see it. Mm -hmm.
So does it provide you information about the film? I can't remember what it says, yeah, but I liked the I liked the ad. Yeah. yeah. I think it, I like again, any good it, ad, I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do you yeah, think I it think should be something good. else to put in to make it more effective? Not at all. No, I think it's good that it has from the actual thing yeah, because it's relatable. To yeah, plus it's not like misleading the audience. As in like they wouldn't see the advert then think, oh I wanna go see it then watch it. Do you think it provides you too much information that you know exactly what the film is? No, not at all. No, not at all. Okay. Yeah. Very effective. Very good, yeah. Okay. That's Sorry. it. Yeah. Well done, girls.